Hi, I'm Gina Tersimani and we're here at PS Evans Restaurant and I won the Ricky competition for 2011 with Rapture of the Ricky. So today we're going to start off by making the church tea that goes into the Ricky. So you're going to go ahead and steep two cups of black tea prior to making your church tea. So we're going to pour this into a pitcher and then we're going to squeeze some fresh orange juice. And when I say fresh, it comes right out of the heart. A little bit of lemon. Here we're going to do a lime. Too bad you can't smell this because it's pretty amazing. And then we're going to match it with the same amount of ounces. So we're going to measure this out and we're going to do two ounces of fresh, uh, fresh pineapple juice that we squeezed beforehand. And I'm not going to tell if you use the face stuff on the can. So now we're going to turn our church tea that we just made into a carbonated soda. So we're gonna get out a handy ISI or EC siphon. And we're gonna fill it up with our church tea. About three quarters of the way. You need to leave a little bit of room for the gas, otherwise it's gonna make a huge explosion. And there we go. Give it a little shake. So now we have carbonated church tea. Grab our glass, now that all the hard stuff is over, we're gonna grab the Woodford Reserve bourbon, which is a nice honey style bourbon, for one and a half ounces. We're gonna put that in there, then we're gonna take our glass and we're gonna fill it with ice. Quickly, we're gonna make what we call a wheel. So we're gonna cut off the end of our lime, cut another small piece, give it a little bit of a, a line, cut in the middle, put it on the side, and that is a wheel garnish. And that is your Rapture of the Ricky, the 2011 Ricky Champion this year. Cheers.